Hi, welcome to Love and Forever Evolving, where we are always and forever evolving. Hello, Virgos. Welcome back, my loves. Welcome to your love reading for the month of December. We're back checking in another three days, Virgos, to see what the energies are like, to see how everything have progressed from the last three days, my loves. Definitely hit that notification bell, my loves, if you're new here, so that way you're notified for when your readings do come out. I do post the vote, the, oh, excuse me, spirit, I'm getting a little tongue twisted here. I think your person, they may be stumbling all over their words, my loves, okay, Virgos? That may be significant for someone there. All of a sudden, I start stumbling over my words, all right? But however, Virgos, I wanted to state that I do post your readings every three days, all right, Virgo, so you can definitely hit that notification bell if you're new here, so that way you are aware when your videos are up next, all right, for your readings, all right? Now, the readings here today may resonate for Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, or South Node placements as a Virgo, all right? And also, cross watchers, welcome, my loves. You are welcome here as well, all right? So first, we're going to start with your higher self, Virgos. We're going to see what messages, spirit, your angels, your ancestors have for you. And then we're going to shift the energies and pull out the tarot deck, all right? And see how your your person, all right, thank you, spirit, or your significant other, or your spouse, whoever that you are exchanging energies with, all right, Virgoans, all right? We're going to tap into their energy and see what messages, spirit, source has for you as well, all right? So let's first start with your higher self. Let's see what spirit your angels and ancestors have for you for ending week of December here. Wow, we have a couple of cards come out here, Virgo. We have the answers you need are coming. Wow, beautiful, all right? So if you were concerned in regards to a situation, Virgo, and you're waiting to hear from this particular person or waiting to hear in regards to results, I'm getting here. The answers you need are coming, all right? No worries, Virgo, all right? Full moon in Gemini. Beautiful. I'm going to set that one right there, all right? Beautiful. So that way that can just marinate there in your spirit, all right? On whatever level it needs to, okay, Virgos? Now, we also have don't let your pride get in your way, Virgos, all right? Full moon in Leo, that's Leo energy. Some of you all, this person may be a Leo. You may need to rectify this situation with the Leo. All right. I'm sure that's very significant for someone. Also, new moon in Gemini. Okay. Definitely go and look up the new moon in Gemini. See what messages spirit your higher self has for you there as well, Virgos. But definitely in regards to the situation, the answers that you are in concerned of, I'm hearing, are on the way. Work through your fears, Virgos, all right? New moon in Scorpio. That definitely, that's Scorpio energy. Some of you on this person may be a Scorpio, but this is definitely going through that transformation process, all right? Going through that stage, right? Cleansing, releasing, all right? Some of you are removing yourself from particular people, situations, circumstances that you no longer are involving yourself around, and you're changing, honey. You're going off with different vibrations that you used to be on or different frequencies, that you used to be on with people, places, and situations. You're no longer vibing with these energies no more, all right? You're transforming, all right, in that Scorpio energy, Virgos, all right? And that's what your spirit, your higher self wants you to know, all right? And then we have balance, spirituality, and practicality, all right? Full moon in Piscean, all right? Some of you this person could be a Pisces, Virgo, or vice versa. You may have Pisces placements in your chart, or needing to rectify this situation with the Pisces, all right? But needing to balance your spirituality, your beliefs, your morals, how you feel, all right? What is your higher self, your purpose here meant to do, all right? And being more practical with that and balancing the reality of things that are around you within your surroundings and what you're manifesting. Your spirit, your, high, your higher self, excuse me, is definitely wanting you to make sure that those energies of yourself and your soul purpose or balance. And the last card again, excuse me, you got a lot of several cards that came out here for you, Virgos, all right? So last card here we have is conclusions are within reach, all right? Wow, Virgos, conclusions are within reach. This is just more energy 
from the card here stating the answers you need are coming in. That's a double confirmation, Virgos. Conclusions are within reach. So whatever, again, that you maybe put a request to get some information about on a particular situation, on a particular person, on a particular, you know, whatever this is that you are manifesting here, you're going to get the answers, the clarity, the understanding I'm hearing as well in regards to this situation here. Wow, beautiful. So let's pull some tarot decks out now, Virgo. Let's shift the energies in regards to your higher self and what spirit wanted you to know, inform you of during this last week of December here. Now let's shift the energies and see how your person, the energies around you feel, your significant other for some of you all, your spouse. All right, let's see how they feel towards you during this time. All right, with the raw tarot deck that I created. And then stick around. We're going to pull again the tarot deck out here to get further clarification, my loves. Wow, beautiful, beautiful messages from spirit and source there. Let's see. Let's see now how Virgos, how does your person feel towards you during this time? What do they want to inform you? Ooh, show me what that tongue can do. Wow, well, well, well. They're definitely in the energy of definitely thinking and fantasizing about you in the bed right now, Virgos. Wow. And they are reminiscing and thinking about how you do things with your tongue. Okay, I'm getting the way you do things with your tongue. All right. It's a feeling that they never felt before I'm getting here. So particularly what you do with your tongue or vice versa, Virgos, what this person do with their tongue, they are engaged with that I'm hearing. So that really engages them. Ooh, fuck it up, Tor Ooh, Taurus. Some of y'all, this person may be a Taurus. I wanted to say Virgo. All right. Wow, that's significant how that channeled out there, okay? That's a fellow Earth sign as well, all right? A Taurus energy there. But however, let's move forward here. Spirit, source, angels, ancestors. How else does this person feel towards my sexy-ass Virgo ones, all right? It's time to put this to an end. Wow, Virgo, so this person, all right, it was ready to put this situation to an end, all right? And I feel like for some of you all, they may, those are the answers I'm getting here. So those are the answers that you're waiting from. You're waiting to hear this from this person, or this person is waiting to hear this from you in regards to the connection here, or in regards to finally putting things to an end, all right? Wow, so some of you all are literally in the energy of putting things to an end, or again, you're waiting for answers here to put things to an end. All right. Wow. Source, thank you, angels, ancestors. All right. I'm sure that's significant for someone to have that channel out there. So let's see here. What else? Let's get one more card in reference to your person here, Virgos. And then we're going to pull the tarot deck out here. Okay. All right. Wow. Beautiful. Let's see. One more card, Source. I am in love with you. Wow. Beautiful, Taurus. So this person is very much in love with you, okay? If some of you all are not aware of that, all right? If some of you all are concerned in regards to that detail, all right? Yes, they love you if that's what you're wanting to know. Yes, again, they are in love with you, all right? And wow, here, let's see what we have at the bottom. Ooh. I want to make sure I have the deck right. I look for you everywhere, Virgos. Wow, so this person looks for you everywhere. They turn here, they turn left, they turn right. All right, they're looking for you everywhere, Virgos, okay? Because again, they are very much in love with you, all right? And they're ready to put whatever this to and in with you, okay? If this is a situation where you two may have fell off, okay, or ended things on bad terms, all right? This is a situation I feel like, Virgos, that this person is wanting to come to an end with, they're wanting to put all to an end because they realize that they are in love with you and some of you that they are still in love with you, okay? Source, angels, ancestors. Let's now shift the energies, Virgos. Let's get further details here. Let's tarot talk now, okay? Wow, if the reading resonated with your spirit, however, Virgos, don't forget to hit that big fat thumbs up. All right, show spirit some love there. And if you're new here again, welcome, my loves. Hit that subscribe button. Be a part of family. All right, where we love and we evolve each and every day. Okay, and definitely if you're enjoying the energies here, hit that join membership tab and become the real evolving spirits there. And definitely receive your 
discounts there. I do go live every other night, Virgos, and you're welcome to hang out with me there. Ask one free question, my loves, in regards to your higher self, all right, in regards to this person, all right? You're more than welcome to ask questions in regards to what it is that you're wanting to know, all right? I go live every other night, all right? That details will be below in the video there that's listed at the end of the video, all right? And definitely hang out with me there, and I'll love to get to know you more and see what messages our higher selves need to know, right? Thank you, Source Angels Ancestors. Let's move on now, Virgo. Let's see here. Let's pull the tarot deck out here again and see how this person is feeling in regards to this love that they have towards you and what it is that they are wanting to put to an end here, Virgos. All right. Wow. Beautiful reading so far. Source Angels Ancestors. What's the messages for the kings and queens here? What's the messages for my Virgo source? What do they need to know? Wow, beautiful. What other card do you want and would want to come out? The justice, Virgos, all right? So this, for me, any situation I see when the justice card comes out, this tells me that this was a situation, Virgos, that you are now realizing that you were treated wrong in, all right? You were taken advantage of. You were manipulated, all right? There was justice that was not being served here, all right? There was unfairness. I'm hearing here, so your higher self, your spirit, your angels, your ancestors is aware that this person may have treated you unfair, all right? They have done several things behind your back, manipulated, lied, did all that shit, all right? And you're aware of that. Why? Because also what came out here was the Ten of Swords, all right? Or vice versa, your person here, this is air energy, Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra placements here, all right, or for some of you all significantly a Libra here with the Justice card. But this is definitely a situation that not only you were hurt in this situation, your person was hurt as well. All right, this was a situation that you both have realized through your own trials and errors, Virgos, through people's situations and circumstances, and how that taught you so many things through your own pain and hurt. All right, but I want you to know that Spirit, your higher self, the universe... Is definitely bringing justice in regards to this situation. Moving forward here, you will now, everything will work out for you. You will be one of those energies that will be blissed for the next cycle to come. All right, which represents the cycle of balance, represents the scale of balance. All right, so you will begin all the justice that you did not receive all this time, all these years for some of you all. Okay, and in regards to these people who individually stabbed you in the back here. All right, Virgos, your spirit, your higher self is informing you now. You will receive justice in regards to what everything I'm hearing that is owed to you. Wow. Last card here. Let's see here, my loves. Yes, the five of swords. I'm not making this up. The energy in the cards never lie. All right. Some of you all could be an air sign. All right. But however here, there was a lot of conflicts, a lot of arguments, a lot of disrespecting, disagreements here, going back and forth and arguing. All right, some of y'all, this relationship just wasn't healthy. For some of y'all, this marriage just wasn't healthy. All right, whatever type of ship this was, all right, it wasn't healthy. And your higher self has realized that through this person and their actions and how they've shown you repeatedly, I'm hearing here, several times of how they stabbed you in the back or vice versa, how they stabbed your person in the back, Virgos. This person has now had enough of that all right and literally has walked away and i thought this person is still just trying to nag at him get whatever they want out of him or her all right whoever this is resonating for because this is a situation where this energy just doesn't get it all right so this is a type of situation where you know it's out of your hands virgo all right you keep doing what you're doing you're gonna get justice in regards to this situation here and allow what they get let them get because it's what they manifested it's their own shit and they're gonna have to sit with it virgos all right you're good okay but however the eight of swords here at the bottom of the deck yes this person is aware this is energy of guilty energy for me okay again some of y'all this is highly energy of an air sign some of y'all this person may just simply have aquarius energy gemini energy in their chart heavy all right libra energy again heavy in their chart but 
they're in their mind, their mental space here a lot in regards to you, Virgos, and what they have done. And they're aware of what they've done here with the Eight of Swords. That's the card of, I'm aware of the things that I've done. I'm aware of my decisions here. Because she can simply let that rope go. It's not tied around tight. It's loose. She can get her feet, both feet, out of their puddle because she's definitely not balanced. And she is aware of that. All right, so this energy, for some of y'all, this woman is aware of that. All right, or again, this person is aware of the wrong that they have done. They're in the wrong. They know that they're in the wrong for what they have done in regards to arguments, conflicts, betraying you. I'm hearing Virgos, okay? They are aware of that. And because of that, again, it's clearly why the justice had to come out in spirit and the universe is letting you know you're definitely going to get justice in regards to the situation. Don't worry about trying to force anything to happen, Virgos. Let everything play out as it is meant to play out, my loves. You are spiritually protected and fucking spiritually guided. I say you keep doing what you're doing, Virgos. I love you so much. Again, if you enjoyed the reading here again, don't forget to like, subscribe, hit the notification bell down below, my loves, and join and be a part of the real evolving spirits where we love and evolve together. Check out those perks there, my loves. Check me out. I will be going live here. All right. Ask your question, my loves. And we are going to spiritually grow and glow and grow together. All right. I love you, Virgos. Bye-bye.